Hello friends and welcome back to another unboxing video. In case you can't tell, we have a massive box here and this is uh, all of my uh, 1 blue letter albums from the Highline store or G-Market. Um, they just came in today and I'm super excited to open them and look at all of our pools. So we'll go ahead and I'll open the package and we'll just get right on into it. It is upside down so that way you don't see my address and all those fun things. So I'm going to be opening it up upside down so we won't judge the uh, packaging too much <laughs> based on that because I'm sure it was not meant to be open this way but oh here everything is oh and I'm seeing pre-order benefits so I'm gonna cover those as best as I can until we can turn it over oh and these are all the things for the Ontario charts so oh there's more all right so I'm gonna stop struggling I'm just gonna do this off camera and then I'll be back once I get it out <laughs> All right, so I'm sure you guys are wondering, why did I order 12 albums? Well, you see, it was to get all of the pre-order benefits. So the way the highlighting did it this time was a little bit different than they did Love, Sin, and Part 1 and 2. They actually had real photo cards this time. Um, previously, they had done, like, postcards and ticket things. So this time around, you got one singular photo card out of three if you bought a single album. And you got one postcard type thing for every set that you bought and there were three of those so I bought three sets which mean I which meant I got all three of the like postcard things and then I brought three individual albums to get all three photo cards so 12 albums in total four of each version super excited to see um, what the pools are because that means we will have had five out of um, five albums um, for each version which is enough to get five of the six pools because there's six photo cards per album so um, and then I do have two more coming in from uh make star i believe wasn't with uh, withdraw my make star announced them i think i did make star um, and i do have pre-order benefits coming in from mmt but i think it's just the pre-order benefits and not to the photo cards which is fine i didn't like make it a goal to buy 18 albums this time but um we got pretty close anyway so enough rambling and we'll go ahead and look at the pre-order benefits let's go ahead and look at the postcard things first they're kind of similar to like uh, monster x fantasia when um Starship Square did um, something like this. It's, it's like the same type of packaging kind of with like the stand. So this is what they look like. They are so cute. So I'm going to pull them out of the plastic so we can get a better look at them. So I did leave the little stands in the plastic and I have them in these like little things. You can open it on the back here and take them out, but I'm going to leave them in for now. Um, there's one from each version. So this is the version one. So cute. Version two is the twinkle lights, which you guys know is my favorite of the concepts and version three is the one from when he's sitting in the closet oh they're so cute i love them so much so i'm super excited to have these i don't know if i'll keep these in the in like these and like display them on my shelves um i do have two of the three from like monster x fantasia era and i do have them just kind of like decorating the very top shelf of my um thing but i don't know it depends on what size these are like if they fit into a three pocket i'll probably just put them into my binder but for right now it is to be determined and then for the photo cards, there were three different ones and I'm super excited because they are all with different, like the football uh, get up. They're not all the same, which I like. They have three, there's three different outfits. So super cute, but these are adorable. So here is the first one in his little football jersey. And then this is what the black looks like. They have, the backs all look the same. And there's this one, which is like my favorite look. I love the Letterman jacket with the blue like highlights in his hair and then the face paint. This is like my favorite. So really like this. Also, I'm sorry, my nails are so chipped right now, but I didn't want to change them because I'm like, this is a Wano video. So I want to keep my Wano nails. So I apologize if they're a little chipped and, and gross looking at some points, but hopefully it's not too noticeable. And then we have this one with the like sequined out <laughs> numbers on the jersey and his blue streaks. And just, oh, they all look so good. He's so cute. His photo cards this era are so, so pretty. Like, I don't think I can get over how pretty they are. So, yes, those are all of the pre-order benefits from the Highline store. So we'll go ahead and we'll just start getting into the pools. So while I'm unwrapping these, I will talk. But essentially, the only thing that's different from each album this time around is the message card and the photo card because the accordion postcards are the same the posters are the same and the bookmark is the same there's, there's really only two random things um i don't remember the message cards off the top of my head and there's not a template for them yet that i'm aware of so that i'll figure out afterwards we're mainly just looking at the photo cards um today um, that's what we're mostly concerned with <laughs> and i am so excited i hope i got some good pulls i hope highline did a good job shuffling because I don't want to have to do too much trading if I can help it, but I know I'll have to do some and that's fine. Um, so I did actually send my template to my work phone, 
so I can show you guys the three that I got last time because they are downstairs in my basement right now. So let me pull that up and we can look at them. Oh, these are the pre-order benefits that we got today. So those are there, but we got the one that had like the, um, it's hard to tell because I shaded it out, but we got the one that had like the green suit top. Then we got my favorite of the Twinkle Lights, which is I think my favorite photo card out of all of them. So super excited about that. And then we got this one that was from where like the booth that he was sitting in in version three. So yes, so that's what we've got. So let's go ahead and we'll start looking through version one. So here is the first one. And if you guys want to see like a full in-depth unboxing, I can direct you to, oh, let's face up this time. I can direct you to my, um, I'll link, what I'm trying to say is I'll link down below my thorough unboxing with my K-Town um, albums. If you haven't seen that already or you want to check it out, you can go ahead. Like I said, it's a thorough unboxing, a flip through, looking at everything. So that's not what this will be. So sorry about that if that's what you came here for, but... <laughs> Um, we'll look at the message cards first. Like I said, I don't really remember which ones I got from the first time around. I don't think it was this one, though. I don't remember, I don't recognize surfing, so we might have two of the three. I'm not entirely sure, though, but we'll obviously compare the ones that I pulled this time. And I figured it out, if you did watch my last one, the way that you tell the difference is this thing here. It mirrors the shape of the bookmark, so all the version ones are cut like this. Um, I think it's version two has kind of like a hexagonal kind of cut and then the version three I believe has like the rounded top. So there are only three per version and you only get the version ones and version one stuff, etc, uh, etc. Et so yes. <laughs> so I feel like that makes the odds a little bit better of at least pulling them, um, like all of them if you buy a lot of albums. So yes, but enough rambling. So that's the message card. And then for the photo card we got... Oh, we got a different one. Oh, it's so cute. I don't remember if this was the golf or the tennis shirt, but it is one of them. My God, they're so cute. His photo cards this time around. So freaking cute. I'm so excited. Highline, don't let me down. Let there be some good shuffling in here. <laughs> All right, the next message card we got. Oh, I was gonna say, I like how Highline is putting everything in like face down on the pages. That first one was the exception, but like all my other ones, everything has been like face down so you don't see it right away when you open it, which I really appreciate. I don't think I got this one either, so I think I actually completed the message cards. I would remember this because this is like my favorite line from Blue, though we are young, we are dumb, we'll just party all night long. So yeah, I'm pretty sure I think I completed the message cards, which honestly, if I don't have to trade for those, that would be great because last time it was like a mess trying to trade for them. Uh, it was a lot. So let's see our photo card. Oh, we got a dupe. Well, it's okay. It's not a complete dupe album because the message card was different, but like hopefully we'll pull some different photo cards in the last two. Yo, I cannot get over the packaging for this album. It is so pretty. <laughs> Next message card. Oh, we got a dupe. The We Are Young, We Are Dumb. Hopefully it's not a duplicate photo card. Highline, we will have issues if I pull the same photo card in every single one. <gasps> oh, yay. We got a different one. This is his red. It's not Ralph Lauren I don't know what the or is that Ralph Lauren I forget what the alligator logo is someone tell me in the comments I don't remember but oh my gosh he's so cute oh his little peace sign his little face oh I love it Yay. okay one more version one also because I just saw it this is the tennis shirt <laughs> just in case you were uh, concerned all right so the next message card is the surfing one. So we did pull two dupes. I'm hoping the first one I got was not the surfing one. I don't think it was, but we'll see. <laughs> and our last version one photo card is, oh yay, okay, cool. So we pulled three new ones. We only have one to trade. Super exciting. Oh, he's so cute. I love this. It's with the white button up. Gosh, and I love that background. Also, sorry if you hear some banging, my dad's cooking dinner. <laughs> I just heard of like a big one. <laughs> But yay, so that was actually pretty good. Three out of four photo cards, not bad, not bad. And two out of the three message cards potentially have the full set done, just not sure because I don't remember what I got last time. But yay, that's super exciting. Let's go ahead and we will move on to version two. So I just realized I was talking for about five minutes and didn't record any of it. All right, so we're on the first <laughs> version and this is the message card I pulled. I think I pulled this one with my first round because the I'm here for you 24 seven is ringing a bell. Um, but I'm not sure. Like I said, I'll put text over if it is. God, I can't believe that. I was literally talking for like a solid, like almost 10 minutes probably about like comebacks and stuff while I was opening the albums. I'll repeat myself. <laughs> but this is the card we pulled and it's so cute. I think this is like my second favorite of the like entire 18 for this comeback because look at him. He's got the cute little face, little winky face with the peace sign bunny ears. Oh my god, he's so precious. 
guys his photo cards just keep getting better and better with each comeback i'm so here for it <laughs> i'm so here for it and the next message card we have is oh this is different from at least the one we pulled today so we for sure have two of the three again <laughs> which is always a good sign i'm really hoping to just like pull them all between i would like to have them all pulled by the end of this one but i know that that might not happen until i get my other two also really sorry for the loud noise um i don't know what my dad is doing now but it sounds like he has the fan on over our stove and it's so loud so i'm gonna try and be equally as loud so that way hopefully you don't hear it too much um, but the next photo card we have is, oh, I love this. Oh my God. I love all these photo cards so much. They are so cute. Version two, I think is definitely my favorite photo card and overall concepts wise. I just love them all so much. My all time favorite concept is from version three. It's the one in the field that I said made me really nostalgic, but as a whole version two is I think my favorite version. So, oh my God, it's so cute. I love it. It's so cute guys. I also just like all the nighttime shoots that they did for version two. I don't know why I'm a sucker for nighttime shoots. Sue me. <laughs> all right, our third message card is, oh, I'm here for you 24 seven again. Again, I really think that this is the one I pulled on my first copy, but I'm not 100% sure. So I've probably already overlaid text on here, like yelling at myself. So I apologize in advance. <laughs> And the next photo card we have is, oh yay, we are three for three. That's really cool. And we got this set. There's two in this shirt. So we pulled both of them. Oh my God, look at how cute he is. I can't get over it. Wow, Highline, I'm impressed with your sorting. I hope I didn't just jinx myself. I think I have faith. I have faith that Highline sorted well and we will continue this trend. I really do. <laughs> It's also kind of like a good sign because like it's been a mix of whether or not the like inclusions are all the way at the back or just on a random page. So I feel like that's also a good sign for um, variability in the pools, but I could be wrong. I could like not be a real judge, but I'm just, I'm just saying it seems promising given the luck we've had. <laughs> and the last uh, message card for version two is, oh, another I'm here for you 24 seven. So we definitely pulled two of the three. It would be nice if we pulled three of the three, but I really think I only have two, which is fine. Again, I don't mind having to trade for these, but it's just gonna be a pain in the behooty to do it. <laughs> and the last photo card we got is, oh, I jinxed it. <laughs> so we did have a dupe album, but that's okay. We're doing pretty good. Three for four, three out of four potential, you know, different photo cards. Actually, we're doing four for five because I didn't pull any of the dupes from my first set of albums too. So that's really good. So yeah, we're doing awesome. If we can keep this up, I will not not to be mad. So yeah, we'll go ahead and we'll move on to version three quick. All right, so I made sure I was recording this time. I'm gonna talk about what I did when I was opening the version two albums that I was not recording for, but I was talking about how I need to um, buy some of my October comeback groups things a while. Um, and I was talking, I talked about this in another video, but like September was kind of nice because Wano, Lisa, um, ATs and I think it was just those ones, yeah. Wano, Lisa, and ATs all had comebacks like, like within a week of each other. So I was able to order all of them at the same time because I was like, well, Lisa's comes out on like a Thursday or something. And then uh, ATs was like a Friday and Wano a Monday or something like that. Like they were really close together. So I was like, I can order them all in one and then they'll just ship out when Wano's comeback happens and they'll get here around the same time they would have anyway. And I can sh save on shipping and just like, you know, do it all in one order. Well, October is not so lucky because I have four comebacks. I have Espa and Hypen, Seventeen, and Kingdom. So Espa and I believe it's in Hypen are at like the beginning of October and then <laughs> Kingdom and um, Seventeen are a day apart, but they're like at the tail end of October. So I don't want to put them all in one order because they won't ship out till the end of October then. So I'm going to have to order two soon and I'm just like not, <laughs> not wanting to do it right now, but I will do it. I have to do it like by the end of this week, essentially. <laughs> um, and I'm like, super excited because it is Espa's first um, physical release. Um, I was originally contemplating collecting two members when they finally did their first physical release, but I'm just collecting too many people right now. I started too many new collections. And to be honest, I love the new groups I started collecting a little bit more. Um, Espa, that might change with Espa's first physical, but um, as of right now, I just wanna focus on one member and I'm hoping that SM does not do a million and two different photo cards for like a member. I hope it's something reasonable. I, I, the, I know the album specs are out, I can look, but 
I'll put in text whether or not I'm disappointed or not when I do. Um, so yeah, just to recap, the photo card we got was the one that had like the booth behind him. So hopefully our luck with pools will continue into uh, version three. Um, so let's see here. What is the first message card? It says, you can tell me whatever you want. I don't know if, if I got this last time. It's not ringing any bells, but again, not entirely sure. So that's our first of four message cards. And our first photo card is, oh, it's the balloons. Oh, I kind of think this is my favorite photo card from this version too. I'm just looking at the template. Oh no, this is my second favorite. My favorite is the one from the outdoor. He's making a kissy face and it's super cute. But yes, oh my God, this is like my second favorite. It's just so cute. I love it. I'm so excited guys. This is like my favorite comeback of the year. I'm not gonna lie. Like I think Blue Letter is my favorite um, release of 2021 so far. It's just so good. I mean, there's obviously been so many good releases <laughs> this year. Like groups have really been killing it this year. I've been so incredibly impressed. And like the new groups I decided to stand, two new rookie groups. I mean, Omega X aren't really, they're rookies as Omega X, but like they've all debuted at one point. Um, between them and Kingdom, uh, I'm just, I'm wrecked all the time. <laughs> um, so our second message card, I'm tired of being lonely. Um, this actually sounds familiar. This might be the one I pulled in my first copies. Again, editing Janessa will put it on the, on the screen whether or not I was right. But again, two out of the three, at least from these albums. So that's really good. And the photo card we pulled is... Oh, yay! So this is the other outdoor one. This isn't the one that's my favorite, but this is a solid contender. This is probably my third favorite from this version. Oh yeah, so we're doing good again. Love that. Guys, we're all we're almost done. We only got two more albums left. I'm sad. <laughs> I'm excited because the photo cards are just so freaking pretty. But I'm sad because it's almost over. I want to keep opening Wano albums. I would really like to host a group order one of these days. I don't know that I would want to do a fan sign because it makes me really nervous. I like in a perfect world I would like a fan sign with Young Wan to be my first because he is my ultimate bias but I am so intimidated to talk like at the, just at the thought of having to talk to him not having to but like getting the opportunity to talk to him makes me so anxious so I kind of would want to do like a fan sign with like Omega X or Kingdom first to just kind of like <laughs> ease into the water but I don't know if I'll ever get there I also don't know that I would get that many people to join but I mean I don't know. We'll cross that bridge someday. <laughs> um, okay, so we got another, you can tell me whatever you want. So potentially all three, but I think it's more like two out of three <laughs> that we have so far, which is fine. It seems to be like the running tally for this. So that's great. Um, and then for the photo card we got, oh, this is the one we got from the first one. So we did pull three different ones out of these albums, but we only have three out of four total different photo cards. So. Yes, super cute. It is a super cute card. Not mad about it. These are all super cute cards. I feel like that's all I've been saying is that these cards are so super cute. And I'm not wrong, but you know, I'm just saying it a lot. <laughs> so I feel like it's getting annoying. All right. And this is the last one, guys. The last one. What is this? It feels like it went by so fast. I know it like took me at least like a solid half an hour to film all this, but it just feels like it went by so fast. <laughs> so we're going to savor it. All right, so the last message card we got. Oh, I definitely got all three. Oh, so it says, take my hand. Let me know when you're ready. It's all in the blue. Yay, so we definitely pulled all three message cards because these are all three different. So that's super exciting. Version three confirmed message cards are done. Version one and version two to be determined. <laughs> all right, let's keep this luck with this photo card. As long as it's different from what is on the screen, we will have pulled a solid four out of five different cards for each version. So. Highline, I trust in you. Yes! Okay, so we did pull a different one. We didn't pull my favorite one, but we did pull a different one. So we pulled four different cards in these four different versions, but in total out of the five I have, we have four different ones. So that's super exciting. We only have one dupe per version so far, so that's really exciting. So I'll probably hold off on trading until I at least get my Make Star albums. I don't know when they're shipping. I should probably check on that. <laughs> Um, but yeah, so let me arrange the frame for the outro and yeah, then we'll get out of here. 
All right, so I didn't pull the message cards back in the frame because there's just not enough room and I figured all the photo cards <laughs> would be much cuter. Um, but that's it for this mega blue letter Wano comeback unboxing. I will probably just throw my make stars into like a mail haul or something when they come. So this will probably be the last dedicated video to blue letter aside from I might film a completing my blue letter collection. I don't know. Since there's not like a ton of like random inclusions this time, I feel like it's not going to be super hard to complete it. Um, I didn't have a super hard time completing it last time, but I feel like this time it's going to be even more like uneventful. Um, but I might do that. So keep an eye out. If not, you'll see me completing it and then updating my binders collection. So yes, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you guys are still streaming blue letter. It's such a good album. I can't stop saying enough good things about it. Um, but yes, I hope you guys are having a great day or night wherever you are. I hope you're staying happy, healthy, and safe, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!